we are asked to simplify the given square roots with decimals. The first example is the square root of 0 0.64. Notice how this does resemble the square root of 64, and because 64 is equal to 8 squared, the square root of 64 is equal to 8. Using this fact, and the fact that if we know we multiply two numbers that have one decimal place, the product must have two decimal places, we should be able to recognize that 0 0.8 squared is equal to 0 0.64, which means the square root of 0 0.64 is equal to the square root of 0 0.8 squared, which simplifies to 0 0.8. The square root of 0 0.64 equals 0 0.8. Another approach would be to convert the decimal to a fraction. 0 0.64 is equal to 64 hundredths, and therefore the square root of 0 0.64 equals the square root of 64 hundredths. And because 8 squared is equal to 64 and 10 squared is equal to 100, we can rewrite this as the square root of 8 tenths squared, which simplifies to 8 tenths, which simplifies to 4 fifths, or the decimal is 0 0.8. Of course, either way, we get the same result. Next, we have the square root of 0 0.09, which resembles the square root of 9, and because 9 is equal to 3 squared, the square root of 9 is equal to 3. And therefore, we should be able to recognize that if we square 0 0.3, we will get 0 0.09, and therefore, the square root of 0 0.09 equals the square root of the square of 0 0.3, which simplifies to 0 0.3. Or again, if we convert to a fraction, 0 0.09 equals 9 hundredths, we can say the square root of 0 0.09 equals the square root of 9 hundredths. 3 squared is equal to 9, 10 squared is equal to 100, and therefore we can write 9 hundredths as 3 tenths squared. The square root of 3 tenths squared is equal to 3 tenths, or as a decimal, 0 0.3. For the last example, we have the square root of 1.44, which resembles the square root of 144. Because 144 is equal to 12 squared, the square root of 144 is equal to 12, which leads us to the square of 1.2 is equal to 1.44 and therefore the square root of 1.44 is equal to the square root of the square of 1.2, which is equal to 1.2. Or if we convert to a fraction, 1.44 is equal to 1 and 44 hundredths. If we convert this to an improper fraction, the numerator is going to be 100 times 1 plus 44, and therefore this is equal to the square root of 144 over 100. 12 squared is equal to 144. 10 squared is equal to 100. We can write this as the square root of the square of 12 tenths, which is equal to 12 tenths, which simplifies to 6 fifths, or the decimal 1.2. So there are a couple ways to approach simplifying square roots when the radicand, or the number under the square root, is a decimal. I hope you found this helpful.